Hi, Pat Love back from Love Healing Hearts. Listen, I want to share something with you because I realize that a lot of young people don't know this. Maybe some of you old ones too. Um, oral sex is sex. Anal sex is sex. Um... Oh my goodness, I'm I'm uh, I'm not that delicate, so I hope I'm not embarrassing you. But the sad part is that is what leads a lot of teenagers into the sexual thing because they think they're playing. They're playing with their little body parts. They're they're fondling each other. They're feeling all over each other. They're you know they're putting their lips where they shouldn't be going. You know they're not putting lips on lips. They're putting lips on other body parts. I'm trying to be delicate. You know, that's not my gift. So my all I want to say to you is be very careful how you play these games. Because inevitably, one thing always leads to another. And I'm, I'm going to tell you, when you get caught up in that, because that's what my ex-husband's situation, my very first husband, not my last one, my last one, my second one was a jewel. Unfortunately, he's not with me. He went to be with the Lord. So, but he was a jewel. But the first husband was adulterous from the second month of our marriage to the eighth year of our marriage. And his hang up was pornography. That's what that was his drug of choice. Pornography. Pornographic magazines, and y'all need to quit looking at that crap. I'm telling you. Pornographic internet, pornographic movies, pornographic uh, dance halls and bars, yeah, strip joints, and the ultimate pornography, prostitutes. All of them, he had every single one checked off. That was his drug of choice. So I say this to tell you, tiddly winking, playing with it, toying with it, yeah, you can only go, you can only do that so far. And um, I have to share this illustration with you. One of my former pastors, and she, you know, she's a very close friend of me and my husband's, and she would sit there and she used this illustra illustration. I'm gonna do, I'm gonna use it for you. Watch. Let's say this is sin, okay. And this is you playing with it. And now you can't get away. You're locked in. It's called a stronghold now. And now you ain't playing with it. And it sure ain't playing with you. But it's got you. And you have the can't help it. And you either like girls liking girls or boys liking boys or boys liking girls and guys and, and girls looking liking boys and girls. And y'all just like to do everything, everything. I mean, there are no limits. You just just, just do whatever because it feels good. You got to have that feeling. You got to have that thrill. You can't stop. You can't stop. And either along comes baby or along comes knock, knock on your door. Sorry to tell you, you have AIDS. I mean, you just, you don't realize there are consequences with this. So you just can't play. Sexual immorality is not a toy. It's not a little playmate. It's not a doll baby. It's not a plaything. It's not a comedy program on TV. It's reality. And it bites. And it has a stinger at the end of its tail. And it destroys and kills. I'm done.